fringe organisers have been anxiously watching the skies all day as they plan their big bash tonight. Jessica Braithwaite joins us with the latest from the Torrance Parade Ground. Jessica. Yes, well, Kate, you never would have thought it, given the weather we were having just a couple of hours ago. But fringe organisers have decided there's been enough of a break in the weather to press ahead with the plans for tonight's opening night parade. Now, a lot of people very excited about that tonight. We've got here the Murder City Roller Girls. They're pumped up. They're ready to go. They're ready to hit the streets. And uh, you do have to admire them for getting out here in the less than ideal conditions. They have made some adjustments to some of the floats that are going to be taking part in the parade tonight. Some of those floats that were due to involve electrical gear and, and sound systems are being reassessed just in case of danger there if they come into contact with the wet weather. But the Bureau does say that we should see better conditions tonight than what we've been experiencing today. I'd expect that there should be at least some light rain still. Um, but it will progressively clear. There will be a lot of more traffic around. There's a lot of roads that have been closed off for fringe events. Um, and there'll just be that increased population around those sorts of events. And so we're really just appealing to people to take some common sense. Uh, all day I'll be saying still come in because the reality is the fringe kicks off tonight. There's 300 shows opening. All these fringe venues are opening their doors. So, you know, the celebration is in all the fringe venues as well. So, you know, either way, there was going to be a lot happening in the city, but as it's turned out, there's also going to be a parade. And these are the guys from A Simple Space here giving us a bit of a taste of what you can expect if you are heading into the city for the Fringe tonight. It looks fantastic. If you are coming in, the pre-parade entertainment starts at 7. Keep an eye out for those road closures that are in place throughout the city. The parade itself kicks off at 8.30. Kate. Thank you, Jessica. That's great news. I've just had to grab my umbrella.